More than six years after she was nearly killed in a mass shooting, Gabrielle Giffords was honored today with a new U.S. warship bearing her name. Roxana Saberi has more on the emotional ceremony in Galveston, Texas. Out of thousands of ships commissioned by the Navy, this is only the 16th named after a woman and the first named after a living woman since Martha Washington in 1776. The Honorable Gabrielle Giffords, escorted by her husband, Captain Mark Kelly, United States Navy, retired. I thought of you in my darkest days. The soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines of the United States of America. We ask so much of you. Despite danger, you say yes. The Navy told former Arizona Congresswoman Gabby Giffords a warship would be named in her honor back in 2012, the same day she decided to resign from Congress to recover from an assassination attempt the year before. Former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton praised the decision to name the ship after Giffords. Nothing gives me greater joy and honor than seeing this great ship named for someone whose strength and resilience is a great lesson to us all. Over 420 feet long, the USS Gabriel Giffords is designed to take on threats such as mines and submarines in the open ocean and close to shore. Admiral Bill Moran. And this wonderful lady is inspiration to every single one of us in uniform and every single one of us who lives in this great country. The Navy's newest warship reportedly cost $475 million and is armed with missiles and machine guns. It will soon head to its home port in San Diego for final tests and training. Don. An amazing ship named for an amazing woman. Roxana, Definitely. thanks.